going on the last few years. Slovis throws past the sticks and it's complete to Amon Ross St. Brown. Kendall Williamson wraps him up, but it's a first down inside. We hope we have something as wild as you guys just had on a up and down roller coaster day in college football. We have a huge storyline that's playing out already. Keaton Slovis, true freshman, making his first career start at quarterback for USC tonight. Opposed by Stanford's Davis Mills, who'll make his first career start tonight. 11 plays, USC march down the field, but the drive stalls inside the five. And a 23-yard try for Chase McGrath on the opening series of the game. Double overtime, Colorado-Nebraska was a classic. You just saw BYU-Tennessee. And now Amon Ross St. Brown breaks free on his third catch of this opening quarter. He takes it out past the 40-yard line. Four yards last week. Stays in the block here. Slovis, deep, St. Brown, inside, it is caught! Touchdown, USC! And what a route, what, what speed, you can see it right here, St. Brown, the ability to just outrun Stanford. I saw it on tape, it's the first thing that stood out, the defensive backs, and really the whole defense, not as fast. They're more physical, they're disciplined, but this USC won. The summer. Slovis fires, tight window, caught by Tyler Vaughns. There he goes, inside the Stanford 35-yard line. Run out by He's Pulse. a good player, he's probably going to be a late round pick. Had to take over for Chuma Adoga. Tyler Vaughn's the intended target, and he holds it in. What a play! A 31-yard jaw dropper from Tyler Vaughn of its hands. You know, Clay Helton and, and Graham Harrell told us this guy's got a big time arm, and you can only see it when you see it in person. Just a three-man rush. Slovis finds a man. He's got Vaughn's. First and goal for USC inside of a minute. Slovis to throw to the goal line. It is caught. Lunge by St. Brown. Touchdown USC. And Keaton Slovis has put the Trojans on top for the first time since early in this game. 11th consecutive completion. St. Brown looked like he broke the plane for him. Ahead of Matt Fink and Jack Sears. Slovis rifles down the sideline, and it's caught in traffic by Pittman again. And it, you, it's got to be on time. The throw's got to be there, and then to do a great job. They're, they're trusting what they're doing offensively. Four-man rush, slant to Pittman, first down and more. Into the red zone, go to Trojans. Reigns is very difficult, but it reminds me a lot of that. And since then, Tyler Vaughn's is into the end zone for a touchdown. When they found out he was done for the year. And I was saying it before, Brian Kelly in Notre Dame changed the, the entire approach, and since then he's been 22-4 20, uh, and four as a head coach the last two years at Notre Dame. And I think Clay has done a lot of the same things. Self-evaluation, realizing, hey, we have got to be a better football team, and I've got to be a better head coach rather than just an offensive coach. And we're seeing it, it's paying dividends already.